They may be coming off the bench, but these current and historic six men made and make a significant impact on their team. Let's see if they can make a significant impact in NBA Live Mobile. Cue the intro. Hey guys, what's good? Rising Phoenix One. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. Hey, this video is presented by the EA Creator Network. All right, all right, all right. It is the sixth man promo. And today we're going to be focusing on two of the three shooting guards, Lamar Odom, our power forward, and of course our GM point guard, Malcolm Brogdon. So we're just going to take a quick look at Brogdon's stats. And in terms of our two shooting guards, we will note, I have played several with this card and he has been an absolute bucket for me. And then for Ginobili, he's been a really good shooter, but his defense and getting swipes and steals has been very impressive. Our power forward is gonna be Lamar Odom. I don't think we're gonna to focus too much on this card. And then we get to our GM, Malcolm Brogdon. So far, I've been very impressed with this card. I mean, look, if I draw a multi-year lineup and he's playing against a 105 point guard, he's not gonna get steals. I mean, that is built into the game. It's not just team overall that's built into the game. It's player versus player based upon their base overall. So, um, you know, if he's playing 100 plus, he's not gonna be getting steals. That's just the reality of it. Um, but if he's playing cards, you know, within the vicinity of his overall, um, he does pretty well for me, both shooting and on defense. Let's take a look at his stats. He has a plus two inside scoring boost to team. Overall, not very impressed with his athleticism stats other than speed, dribble speed, quickness, maybe vertical at 85. He's got good height at 6'5". Got good rebounding stats for a point guard. Has a pretty good looking inside offensive game. And then his perimeter shooting is looking good. 87, 89, 88, 91, 91. So yeah, with the boost, um, this card shoots very well. And then his defense, 91 on ball is very high. 88 steel is actually very high too. He also has a 92 interception and an 89 drawing offensive foul. He has some very good defensive stats. His playmaking stats, however, are not good at all, which is a little bit surprising for a point guard. And that's pretty much it for Malcolm Brogdon. All right, let's go to our lineup. All right, here we go. So our placeholders at small forward and center are Tatum and Bam. I mean, I can put the athleticism boost item in there, but I'm gonna stay a 94. So I figured, hey, we're basically playing with the backcourt. Backcourt means shooting. Why not just take the shooting boost item because it's not taking us down at all. So the boost to team looks like this. Plus four, a little weak to athleticism. Plus four to rebounding. Two to inside scoring. Plus 13 to perimeter shooting. Plus two to defense. And that's it. So we're going to run the first one with Clarkson at shooting guard. And then we're going to go with Manu Ginobili. So let's get Clarkson back in there. Before we get into the gameplay, let's talk real quick about this uh, promo format. Uh, not at all happy uh, with the changes they made. The way you get one of the 90 overalls um, is through the tokens. The way you get the tokens is through the achievements. This is a long-standing achievement-based template, and it used to be five tokens get you 190. Why does that matter? Uh, because there's only five tokens you can get if you're no money spent. But they upped the token requirements just to get a 90. So from the no money spent perspective, at eight tokens for a 90, you can't get one. And from a spender perspective, the cost or economy for this promo, if you want to go all the way to the Grand Master, you know, going from five to eight tokens for each one of the 90s and you got to get five 90s in order to claim the grandmaster being honest i i'm disappointed and discouraged uh, with the pattern that we're starting to see uh, where things are getting harder for no money spent just to get a master and much more expensive uh, for a spender 
right, to get the Grandmaster. Uh, I would love to see that trend reversed. All right, so yeah, that's my review of the promo format. Uh, in my opinion, it stinks. All right, so let's go into showdown. We'll run two. Let's get it. Well, speak of the devil, a 107 point guard. So 15 overalls above Brogdon. Um, look at this, a 107, a 102, a 100, and then a couple elites. Sad. All right, let's go. Going to Clarkson in the near wing. Nice, 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 Jordan, let's go. All right, defense, zero chance in this game. Zero chance that Brogdon's gonna get a steal on that, uh, get the block on that 107 Frazier. Let's get it to Brogdon. Euro step, layup, beautiful. Nice, Malcolm Brogdon, we're up five to zip, let's go. So, I mean, the key is, I guess, just try to get a steal. All right, nice interception by Bam. Oh, wow, was that Pope? Caldwell Pope? Oh, did you see that Frazier come flying in? Wow. All right, we'll go way deep. The hell with you guys, right? You wanna keep blocking us? We'll go way deep, and Brogdon will bury the three. Gosh darn, what a weird possession. Come on, come on. Just keep him from driving, keep him from shooting. Ugh. Nice board by Jordan Clarkson. Let's go. Top of the key. And he, wow. Okay, that's very unusual. I mean, that was a total brick. Wow. Come on. Now get in front of him. Just stay in front of him. That's it. He's too fast. I mean, he's, he's a 107. We got a 92. All right, come on, 92. Malcolm Brogdon, there you go. In your face. 107, Frazier, in your face. All right, 11 to two. It's tough when you know you're not gonna get steals. Get the block, that was a block, and it went in. Oh, well, that was 100 versus what? I don't know who that was, either a 90 or a 92 overall card, so um, that's part of the built-in player advantage, disadvantage. Nice three by Malcolm Brogdon, so he's hitting his shots, looking good. I don't even know why I'm bothering to swipe, but I have to. <laughs> but I have to. Get the board. There you go. Odom with the board. We're going to go over to Clarkson in the slot. Boom. There you go, Jordan. All right, 17 to 4. Can we get it back? Can we get it back? Maybe hold them from scoring. That's in. Oh, no. Okay. That's in. Good defense. Doggone it. That's 100 versus a 92. That's going to go in every time. All right, let's go. Come on, hit it. Buzzer beater. There you go. All right, 20 to 6. Kind of a scramble, right? Kind of a scramble, plus 14. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, and we'll take the dub. We will take that dub. Well, here we go. All right, this looks more reasonable. 93 overall, season eight lineup, looking pretty good. Um, Luca is kind of a pain <laughs> to play defense against. He just is. The card moves around, he's fast, and of course he has that height as well. So I think he has a two inch height advantage over Brogdon, which is not a huge deal. All right, remember, this is Ginobili. Boom, there we go. There we go, Manu Ginobili buries the three from the slot. Woo, get on him, Malcolm. Get it, nice, nice. Luca picks him up. Let's slip behind that little screen by Ginobili and Brogdon buries the shot. Get it, come on, get it, get it. Oh shoot, I thought he had the steal. And 
he just goes around everybody. That's little Allen Iverson, 93 overall, boosted to a 95. All right, let's go to Odom. Let's give Odom a shot, and he does a layup. So there's a, there's your Odom gameplay right there. I just don't think much of this card. There's too many better available power forwards out there. Come on. Good grief. Long possessions. When you can't get steals, long possessions. And Cat buries a bomb three from the top of the key. Eight to five. Ouch. Take that little screen again by Ginobili. And nice. Nice. Malcolm Brogdon hitting his shots as he does. He's a good shooter. And he's a good defender, but you're not seeing it here today. Nice block. Nice block by Brogdon. Let's get it back to him. Deep in the wing. Oh, bricked it. He bricked it. Wow. Jeez. There goes Iverson again. What's he going to do? No way. Nice board by Ginobili. Let's go. Let's go. Bury it, Manu. Bury it. Nice. All right, so, all right, it was eight to five, now it's 14 to five, that's a little bit better, but we're running out of time. They're doing a lot of passing. There you go, Manu, that's what we were looking for. That's what we were looking for. Bury it over Iverson, nice. That's that zone, and Iverson is the shooting guard, so he has the near wing, and he's only six feet tall, so that's a good place to shoot from against the zone. There you go, Manu. Yes, yes, just what we needed. Buzzer beater needs to go. Oh, <laughs> it went all right. It went all right. It danced around the rim for a little while. Uh, 20 to 5 plus 15, basically same margin. And yeah, we'll, we'll take our dump. We'll take it. All right, it's a work morning for me, so we need to wrap this up pretty quick. Um, I wasn't super impressed with how Brogdon, Ginobili, and Clarkson played compared to the gameplay I played with them that I didn't record yesterday. I mean, you didn't really get a chance to see Brogdon show his defense. In that first gameplay, it was a 107 point guard he was against. He wasn't going to get a steal against a 107. And then in the second one, it is Luca. And Luca, and most people will tell you this, Luca's a pain to try to get steals from and to defend. Although Brogdon didn't get any steals, he also held Luca to zero points. Uh, Ginobili and Clarkson, I, I think they played about the same, except Manu has the defense. Uh, that Clarkson seems to lack, but Clarkson has better perimeter shooting stats. And then there's Odom, you know, he got a layup, okay. So guys, uh, I was gonna wish you good luck with this promo format, but given the changes that were made to this uh, promo template some time ago, um, you know, luck isn't gonna help you, right? You know, money spent, you're not even gonna be able to get one card. And if you're a spender, you know, get ready, right? Get ready because you're gonna feel the pain in this revised promo template um, if you're going after the Grandmaster. So yeah, it's just, I, I don't get it. I really don't, I don't get it. There's so many other issues with the game. Um, why would we be making things harder and more expensive? I mean, that is so far above my cubicle grade that I, I probably shouldn't even be bringing it up. I don't care, right? I don't care. Um, it bothers me. It bothers me, so I'm going to talk about it. I right, that's it. It's over. It's done. We're out of here. There's no more. And as always, peace out.